Hi, welcome to Ucanic. Uh, today I'm going to be showing you how to do uh, a software update and how to check for software updates on the Tesla Model 3. Uh, so here's the home screen. If you go down to the bottom left hand corner, you see the car icon and then go to software. So here it'll tell you about your car, VIN number, mileage, uh, autopilot, all that. Um, at the bottom here, this is where it tells you what your, the latest software update you have is. And this is a, a good feature to look at. So software update preference, here you can set it to standard or advanced. Uh, standard will give you the updates slower. Um, so if you're one of those people that, that you don't like to be one of the first ones to have the update and wait till it uh, gets some of the kinks out, um, then you should choose that. Um, I like to choose advanced um, and be be one of the first to try out the updates. Um, also, if you click this uh, eye right here, it'll it'll kind of tell you what I what I said there about uh, the the difference between the advanced and standard. Um, one thing to look at too is here where it tells you what your uh, software currently is. If you go over here to release notes it'll actually tell you what's new in the last update that you had so this is kinda cool to scroll through and see what was changed by the update um, so so this will tell you some of that stuff it'll even tell you what the previous update what was new on that one as well so that's a cool little feature to to check out once you download the software um, also, you can do these over the air through the LTE data network, um, but it's a lot quicker and uh, better to do them at your home through Wi-Fi. Uh, that's what Tesla recommends and I recommend as well because it, it just will download them quicker and, and not use data to download. Um, so that's how to do a software update and check uh, out the release notes on a Tesla Model 3. Thanks for watching.